Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to make a simple scatter plot graph um, and showing, you know, whether there is a linear, how can you find out whether there is a linear relationship between two variables or not on SPSS. So it's very simple. So we have our two variables here. Both are continuous variables. One is cultural intelligence and culture shock. So our hypothesis um, is actually that as culture shock, as cultural intelligence increases, culture shock reduces. So we want to find out whether they do have a linear relationship. And so for that, we go to graphs, we go to legacy dialogues, you go to scatter slash dot, and you click on that, and you do a simple scatter. Fine. Now here you're going to select your y-axis and x-axis. So y-axis, we are going to put um, culture shock. And x-axis, we are going to put culture intelligence. Okay. And we are simply going to click OK. And here we have our scatter plot. Now, if you want to find out whether there's a linear relationship between the two, you double click on this graph and here you can see there is a fit line, right? Click on this fit line and this box will open on its own and here it already selects linear because that is the relationship between the two. So you can see that there is a linear relationship between these two variables. And then you just close this box and you can close this as well. And you have your graph showing that there is a linear relationship between culture intelligence and culture shock. And uh, if you want it the other way around, you can also again go to legacy dialogues, scatter, define, these, you put cultural intelligence on y-axis, culture shock on x-axis, okay. And here is your other graph. Again, you double click on this, click on add fit line at total over here. Once you click, linear is already selected. This is the linear relationship. And now you have your graph. And if you want to copy paste it anyway, you just right click and click on copy and you can just paste it in your word document or anywhere else that you need to paste it and that's it it's very simple so thank you everybody for watching if you still have any questions please put them in the comments below and thank you